Hello guys, how you all doing? Jenny has prepared this delicious obono soup. I was craving obono soup, so join me, let's prepare it. So this is my meat. I first of all parboiled it and wash it again. Now I'm seasoning my meat with some maggie cube, some salt, uh, my uh, chicken uh, classic uh, no seasoning and my uh, yeah the two together yeah this is the shaking flavor um no seasoning so after that i just cover it to be cooking while i blended my pepper because literally i wasn't even having blended pepper at home so i just decided to okay let's blend some pepper now this blender was bought for me by my husband most uh electronics i have in my kitchen is bought for me from my husband <laughs> oh my god i can't thank him enough to be honest so I was burning this pepper and this pepper was so hot. Ah, was so hot because normally I used to buy my things from Nigeria, from Africa. They put it here for me. Um, but now I wasn't even having anything. So I decided to go to a normal Africa shop here and buy things. So now moving on to the Ogbono, after blending the pepper, I just add some oil to it. See, here, let me tell you, this oil is good. This is one of the best oil we have here in Europe believe me it does not smell it looks nice it's not colored this is genuine oil so i'm going to melt the obono inside my microwave so that those uh, seeds will melt everything will melt well now i soak my store fish with hot water boiled water so now i'm uh, adding pepper to my meat i added uh, uh streams blended streams and i added crayfish i make sure you see uh, the fast let's just say this soup is practically made of fishes <laughs> so now i added my stuffed fish so they boil together after that i took them out i took the meat out then in my meat stock i just transfer my obono into it the obono was not too much so i just decided to make something that is not too much so i allowed the obono to you know boil very 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 well then I added, uh, I think I added some seasoning to it, yeah, just like so, just for maggi cube. If you know me very well, I don't cook with too much maggi uh, and too much like stuff like uh, uh, seasonings like that. So I went ahead and add my meat. Yes, I just used two meat. I used main use of my barbecue meat and my chicken. Yeah, that was the meat I used then. I added my fresh fish because I always like my soup to have fresh fish, either fresh fish or smoked fish. So I move on to this fish. I don't know what the name of this fish though. I was trying to remove the bone here. Yeah. If you know the name of this fish, you let me know in the comment section and God will bless you. So I'm just removing the bowl uh, that is in the middle and I wash the fish with hot water then transfer into my soup look look at soup now negodo just negodo eh? just negodo just look at the soup so i will always say this why you are cooking test oh so you know what you are adding and what you are not adding so i just added a little bit of water because i don't like my soup to be too you know uh too thick so i added my dried punky leaf that was brought to me by my mom this was important <laughs> I really do not use it for my soup because my kids don't like it but I, this was what I was craving this was what I pictured in my mind so I just have to so now the soup is ready and I'm going to go ahead and serve it yes the soup have cooled down this is how it look like save with pepper the damn eat or pass tell me in the comment section peace